go. 68. Get some uh, wires and some other things. Looks like probably some window glass. So it looks like we're still going to be on the door. wires here. Looks like there's three LEDs so they're going to be lit. Okay, so this looks like a piece of window glass. Just plastic of course. This looks like another piece and look at that. It looks like it's going to have a gear so you can roll it up and down. These look like the gears. Let's see, we got some HP screws, a couple AP screws. We got this big gear or sprocket, and two little ones, and then another little, I think that's like a wire hold down. At least that's what it's been in the past. We got, uh, this is all one piece wire with three bulbs on it, so it's not like three different wires, so that's good. And that is the piece we're going to run first on the door here. So I'm just going to go up this uh, channel, the wire does. And the bulbs are just going to go kind of in order of how they are for the wire. We're going to get this in there. I don't know if it only goes in one way or it looks like it's just round. So all right, so it just slides in. Next one in. And then the last one. So that's going to be kind of, that's neat that it's going to light up. Alright, so they all just push in. Seems like they're in there pretty firm. We get the wires kind of down out of the way there. This one is going to run up. The like window channel here, and the pillar. You can see the little spot there, which we'll put this little piece there to hold the wire down with an AP screw. Get that open. Get that on the screwdriver ready. There we go. So I don't really know how much of this is supposed to, to hang out. It doesn't really... I don't think it says. Alright, anyway, moving on to the window, or the gears. Interesting to see how that's going to work. So 
it looks like. Let's see which one do we take first. I think we take the little one. There are three different sizes. Of course, there's the biggest one. And these ones are different uh, thickness. So let's ever take the, the thinner one. We go right there with an HP screw. make sure that that's going to spin. So it's going to be the whole purpose of having these uh, gears in there so they spin. No, I'm getting ahead of myself. I use the other one. So here's where you want to make sure these wires are going to be out of the way. That one there like that. Make sure the wire isn't touching it. I made that one too tight. There we go. And we put the big one in there. And make sure the wires are far enough down. Everything spins good, okay. Well, that's going to be how you do the window up and down, is this little roller here. So move all these little gears. And then grab the window. It's going to fit in there. I think it'll work uh, better once you get the other side. That kind of hold it in place better, I'm guessing. And that's kind of it for the issue. So these pieces won't be used probably till the next one. But it is a pretty neat little setup there. How they can they can fit that all in the door. It's very sticky and doesn't slide very well. But I'm wondering if that's because we don't have everything there yet. Alright, so that's the issue. We got more door parts, probably the other side of the door to put on for the next issue. Watch out for that one.